So this project is hosted by Teens in Service. It's an Apple High Club, and we're basically focused on raising global awareness and competence uh, through service projects in the community and abroad. So um, we've hosted uh, shoe drives, we've done canned food drives, Jack's trying to raise money to build a school in Ecuador, and um, we had a even a Teens in Service trip to Nicaragua last summer. We took about 14 young people last summer to Nicaragua to teach English. And so that was focused more on sort of education and literacy. Um, and those students sort of worked to learn about Nicaragua and to learn about literacy. And then they went for a week to actually teach in their summer camp program. Yeah, so Love and Literacy is basically a book drive that we're hosting at Napa High until March 18th and we are raising books for grades K through 5 and they can be gently used or new and um, we're hoping that we can deliver these books to the children. Corinne really started that drive and had the passion around that. Corinne um, Chai and, and Addie Groves and some of the other, Caitlin Carlton. So I coordinated with Karen Hatton. She is a teacher at Shear Elementary School and so we contacted her seeing if she would be interested in hosting these reading circles uh, but I thought that we should raise the books at Napa High first. I think since we just launched this project, we only have about 15 or 20 books, but I'm hoping to raise a lot more if each person could just bring in a few books. I believe that reading is really important because um, it allows students to learn about things that they didn't know and become inspired by books and by their education. Reading for me has kind of been a way for me to, you know, escape reality or, um, you know, learn about different things that I've never would have even been interested in before.